In this video, let's learn how to enable noise suppression in Microsoft uh, Stream videos. Noise suppression is nothing but removing the background um, uh, noise or music and, and make the, the, uh, the spoken word much audible. Uh, so this is a new feature that just got released uh, just not long ago in Microsoft Streams. In this video, I'm going to show you how to, do, how to enable noise suppression on your videos. So let's jump onto Microsoft Streams and have a look at it. So uh, I'm just going to change this a bit. Okay. So here we are in uh, Microsoft Stream. And as you can see, uh, I've got a few videos. I'm just going to just bring up this video here. And if I'm just going to go ahead, I'll quickly go ahead and play the video. And along came 3D printers. And now I can make things uh, that would be hard to make with injection molding. So it gives me a lot more freedom. So as you can see in that video there, uh, there's actually a lot of background uh, noise because you can see it's it's been recorded in a in an open space and there's people out uh, you know behind the speaker and uh, the you know this what the speaker is saying is audible but there is actually some background noise. So let's go ahead and, and enable noise suppression and see how it makes uh, a change. So to to, to do uh, the enable the noise suppression, all you have to do is you have to be an uh, the owner of that video. If not, uh, if you're an admin of Microsoft Stream, you can enable that as well. So in this case, I'm not the owner. However, I'm uh, I'm actually a admin on Microsoft Stream. So I'm just going to switch to admin mode. Give it a quick pause. And here you can actually see now I'm able to see uh, a lot more controls uh, on, on, on the panel there. So I just go ahead and say update video details. And here um, you can actually see there's uh, a noise suppression feature, right? So you just go ahead and turn on and you just go ahead because uh, this video is already published. You don't actually see uh, you don't need to really publish it uh, again. However, uh, you just have to go and click apply. And once it's been applied, if you now go and listen to it. Along came 3D printers, and now I can make things uh, that would be hard to make with injection molding, so it gives me a lot more freedom. And I can go in a lot more directions at the same time, which I like to. So now you can see the difference, right? Uh, so the before, uh, I, is is there's a lot of background noise uh, but now with the noise suppression enabled uh, the background noise is gone so that actually helps especially if you're shooting videos in uh, the open space uh, like open of uh, open plan offices or if you're shooting videos in uh, on on uh, you know in a you know you're outside the office uh, where there's a uh, noise of uh, you know traffic and stuff stuff like that so uh, let's actually have a look at uh, how you could do the same thing on a video that you are actually owner of so i'm going to turn off the uh, the admin mode and just go to my content here go into videos there and have a few uh, sample uh, videos there so I'm just going to bring up one of those this is a, a and uh, similar you see now uh, same thing uh, if you're the owner of the video in this case I've uploaded the uh, an online recording of the video as well so uh, in an online meeting for example if there's any background noise you can use the same feature to do the noise suppression so just go into edit details and there is your noise suppression uh, feature so you just enable and apply. So there you have it. That's how you would actually go about enabling noise suppression on your videos in Microsoft Stream. It's a great feature if you're actually uh, recording videos in a in a very noisy environment, either in your open plan offices or uh, you know outside your offices. Thanks for watching. Uh, my name is Jag Kakarlapudi. I'm the founder and principal consultant at Modernberg Group, uh, based in Melbourne, Australia. Thanks for watching. Cheers.